hailing from New Gotham, weighing 265 pounds, he is the final boss, Bruce Wayans! Bruce Wayans here, I mean, two questions. One, is that Matt legal? And two, is he any relation to the Wayans brothers? One, no. Two, I don't know. There you go, answers, I got him. Well, I mean, I'd love to see Keenan Ivory or Damon out here, that'd be amazing. That would, that would be pretty good, I mean. Like the attire though, the tie is sharp. And opponent number two. Completely legal as long as he doesn't use it. Flying out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, he is the Prince of Aviation, Mondo Rocks! Mondo Rocks here at Versus Pro Studios. The Flyboy himself. I'm honestly shocked. Mondo's usually a crowd favorite. And yeah, Mondo a crowd favorite here in Las Vegas, except for here at Versus. I Versus know. Mark dealing Mondo Rocks today. Well, I mean, those are some awesome shades. Maybe people are just seeing their own reflection in sunglasses and disappointed in themselves. That could be. Fun. Yeah. I mean, with Mondo <laughs> out here, this is going to get high paced and fast really quick. I think it'll win him over once they see him wrestle. And the final competitor. Hailing from the year 2025 via time travel, he is Godspeed, Eli Quick. Um, this we're just going to put that in afterward. This will be edited in afterwards. CTI in. I mean, uh, but does he realize we're not them guys? We don't have that kind of money. We're, we're not CGI. video services. We don't have that. Uh, yeah. Maybe we'll give them a call. and can work it out. I mean, is that an exposed brain on the top of his, his gear? I'm not sure, Bobby. I mean, that is Godspeed Eli quick? Well, he is quick. I don't know how quick he's going to be. It was a brain. That was definitely a brain. It I was a brain, looking, yeah. We're looking right at brains brain. right now. That's that, yeah, see? Bruce Wayne's noticing there's an exposed brain. I mean, I would go for it. If I was in this match, you would think. Oh. Mondo Rocks and Godspeed teaming up on the big boss. Well, I mean, that's what you do. Smart move by the two men. Oh, breaking right. Wow. Godspeed turned inside out and upside down. And when you pull off moves like that, you can definitely call yourself the boss. Good Lord, after that ginormous elbow. Mondo's going to be held at the gate. And now Godspeed is uh, suffering not any better over in the corner right now. Getting thrown around like a rag doll. Wow, just like the 80s arcades, the boss takes your quarters and leaves you going home crying. And Mondo rocks, ready to step up to the boss level now. Yeah. Oh, some fast feet flying. Straight out of the future is Godspeed and some of his moves too. Roll up, nice kick out. Oh, well, a punch to the mouth is just as effective as a kick. Yeah, nothing will slow you down quicker than a punch in the mouth. No. And that's why Mondo Rocks is the prince of the sky right there. Call air traffic control. That was a flifty dipty DDT. Yeah, you might want to look behind him, though, yeah. because, uh, yeah, you had another opponent there, Mondo. Wow. Huge big boss slam right there. That was like 960 rotations. I think he just beat Tony Hawk's record. Good Lord. I got dizzy just watching it. I know. 
All righty. Oh. Godspeed. Backflip cartwheel clothesline. Wow. And a standing Phoenix splash. Holy crap. Is that what they call that? Only a two count. That, that was close. I, you know, it does not get any closer than that. No, that was seconds. Like nanoseconds away from a three. Any closer than that, the bell would have been ringing. Uh-oh. But here, here's what you run into in a three-way dance. There's always a third participant in there ready to take advantage. You've got to have eyes in the back of your head and you keep your head on a swivel in yes. a multi-man match of any kind. Yes. And the boss has the bat. Up and over. Wow. And in a triple threat match, I mean, that bat could come into play. Because as we know, triple threat matches, no disqualifications. See, now right here, he, he should have went for the pin. That was an amazing body slam. Should have went right there for the one, two, three. Amondo is still young in the pro wrestling games. Yeah. It might be a little bit of sign of his inexperience right wow. there. Wow. Airplane but. spin. Face smasher doubled up. Uh-oh. The boss has got a bat. He's got a bat. The oh. Boss trying to get Mondo to use the bat to bash Godspeed's brains I mean, we brains all know in. that Mondo's a straight shooter. I don't think he's going to go for this. Wait, it looks like it looks like he's thinking Maybe he about will. it. Maybe Mondo. he will hit him. Oh! And the Home boss run. is going to taste of his own bat. Well, that's what happens when you bring plunder to the ring. Sometimes it bites you in the face. And it looks like, oh, big headbutt from Godspeed. How did that not hurt Godspeed with that exposed brain? I was wondering the same thing, uh. but I didn't want to ask. You know, uh -oh. the brain's just right there. And Didn't start for the run. Uh, doing laps here. Wow, 90 mile an hour elbow. Talk about misdirection. And that's oh. it right there. The winner of this match, Godspeed, Eli Quick. Huge win from Godspeed, Eli Quick here today. Does uh, anyone have a... I left my radar gun in my other suit. Good Lord. Well, again, it goes back to triple threat rules. You think you got it, and that one guy always hits you from behind. Uh, sure.